So, um, Lisa, she had a bit of a tough time of it uh, towards the end of last season. She was beaten and her legs were broken, so I think it's going to be more stress-free next um, It's going to be more stressful? Stress-free. Oh, stress-free. Well, yeah. <laughs> Lisa's dealing with uh, quite the decision this season coming up. She's got to decide which, which side she's on, the fifth column or the Bs. Uh, but her mother's definitely shown that she uh, she's an evil woman, and Lisa now, I think, is more aiming towards the fifth column. Um, so I would say there's probably more stress uh, and trauma ahead for her, and uh, <laughs> she's being groomed for the throne. So um, she's got to make some decisions pretty quickly about what she wants to do. What would you like to see her do? I would... It's uh, a good question. I... I'm torn because I think it would be very uh, surprising to the audience if she remained on the V side despite her feelings, but I think it's pretty obvious she's going to join the fifth column. Um, she hopes to protect Tyler, but I think Tyler's going to go to the V side, so they're going to probably be pulled apart by their beliefs and differences. Um, and uh, I think she's gonna, my character's going to match up against her mother and duke it out at some point. Yeah. How do you think she really feels about Tyler? Really feel? My character? Um, really loves him. Uh, I know that was question uh, at the beginning of the first season, whether her motives were true or not. At the beginning it was a task. She had to find him for a purpose, and that purpose will be discovered in season two, why Anna's so interested in Tyler. But uh, she slowly fell in love with him. I mean, they've experienced some new stuff together that neither one of them had experienced before, um, seen on the shuttle, things like that. Um, so I think it's a legitimate love between the two species. Now we know you're back for the final season of Smallville. Yeah. Uh, how many episodes is that? When are you back? Uh, I think I'm only back for one. I I've only been told about one so far. And with V, it's kind of hard to do both. But uh, I actually start filming, I think, this week. And uh, it'll be a great episode. I just read it. What, what sort of things can we expect? Um, I'm not really going to be able to say too much, but uh, definitely a lot of uh, Clark and Kara discovering their past and, and what she's found while she's been away for the year, um, about their family, uh, trying to not say too much, but, uh, <laughs> it, there, you know, people have always wondered why Clark can't fly, and that's going to be kind of discovered in, in this episode, and it'll be good. It'll be the usual, like, banter between the two of them as well as cousins. It's the tenth season. Uh, do you think it's the right time to end the show? I, I feel like I haven't been a part of the show enough to say that. I only did season seven. Um, it, I mean, it's been such a great show with such a great following. I, I, I don't think it should ever end. Um, but, you know, everything has to come to an end at some point. And they, they've had a great run. And I know this season's going to have a lot of guest stars returning. So, um, you know, you never want it to end, but sometimes it has to, I guess.